Back at Jack Burford Chevrolet, Michael Watkins, Samantha Burford here with our man James Cornelison to kind of keep us up to date and fill us in what's going on here, James. Uh, tell you what, looking around the lot, you guys have got some awesome vehicles once again and updating daily, it seems like, getting new stuff in. Talk about some of the cars you guys have on the lot right now. Yeah, so definitely our uh, biggest part of our inventory is Silverado, which has done really well with this new redesign. I mean, we've got over 65 on lot right now. The truck's really moving and doing well. Buyers on this truck love this truck. You've got to come out and see this redesign Silverado. It's unbelievable. The technology is impressive. Uh, it's, Tell it's, us about it. Oh, uh, it's the bar camera, none. How yeah. many cameras are on it? I mean, it's... on this high country sitting outside the door, I mean, you've got six cameras on this thing. You can look at it from each angle, curves angle. You can look at it from the backup angle, yeah. trailering view, uh, from the cab. I mean, it's unbelievable what this truck can do. Even the side mirrors. Yeah, side that, mirrors. Yeah. yeah, I mean, it's side blind zone alert. I mean, these, these trucks are uh, they're gorgeous on top of all the technology. It's great. Do you have so, a selfie stick camera in there? What's that? I'm a sure you can put stick one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what we yeah. need yeah. sometimes. Da uh, uh, mount one on the dash be yeah. perfect. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Uh, Samantha, you said that he was going to talk about the transparency of some of these vehicles and everything going on with them. So kind of yeah. ask him about that. So basically what we'd like to talk about realistically is like, you know, going to dealerships, everybody's so has this stereotype about dealerships right yeah. so what we're trying to guard against is realistically you know have you ever been to a dealership and you sit across from the salesperson yeah you know you sit across from the salesperson it feels very guarded you have these walls up well we want to break down the walls okay and you know we have we're testing kind of a, a way to pitch deals around a round table and uh, sit next to a client and you know talk to each other about the deal we have iPads every one of our sales reps have iPads that we can show you what we're looking at the history of the vehicle we're fully transparent about you know the history report what we've done to the vehicle as far as used car inspection or new car or things of that nature we can turn it around and show you the worksheets you know our guys are fully transparent and have all the authority in the world to turn it, uh, your iPad around and show you what they're doing we want to sit by you and do your deal you no know let it, let it and let us know I mean let us know if that would be something that you would like mm -hmm. and come and let us uh, have the opportunity to earn your business yeah and that's cool too because you're not just you know they're, they're showing you what they're doing what they're looking at yeah. the numbers they come up with it's all right there in front of Absolutely. you and how they got those numbers so yeah. that's really cool because you know you, you could go to a place and it, so, so you can do it online now but you guys coming here you're talking to them you're trying to figure out what they want exactly right. and that's a lot better than doing it by yourself yeah. get somebody there to kind of walk you through that process right and ultimately too like would you start the experience online i mean you know, a client may come in and they might, you guys might be ready to go and you're 85% done. All we have to do is the final paperwork. Yeah. I mean, you know, we can work your deal however you feel comfortable with working it. You know, we're very adaptive to that. Uh, James was telling us or telling, uh, maybe my child, somebody was telling me that you guys sold a car over Facebook. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Just yeah. someone didn't even come in the dealership, mm -hmm. just sold it over Facebook yeah. and then came and so in. So basically did all the work over Facebook. And then, of course, there's still a few pieces of the puzzle that you have to finish up in right. store. And I don't ever really think the human the human contact is still never going to be a part of it. But yeah. I mean, pretty much that deal was about 95% done besides the finance paperwork. Wow. How and by doing it out of store, it really speeds up the process in store because right. nobody wants to sit here two or three hours. We don't want you to sit here two or three hours. We want you to be yeah. Uh, fully transparent about what we're doing and feeling good about your purchase whenever you leave because we, there's nothing to hide here. And, and, and too, you know, when you come in here and you know what you want, if it's if you're done with it already, it's just you can get in your car and you go, and it's just it makes the process so much quicker. Oh, absolutely. Now, when you look at the vehicles on the lot, do you have a do you have a personal favorite that you're just crazy about now? Yeah, I can't keep my eye off of uh, the High Country yeah. Silverado. That's I mean, what I'm talking about. Absolutely, just the the new redesign, the technology, the inside, the outside, they're just gorgeous. Yeah. I mean, they really are. They're absolutely phenomenal. And then, uh, you know, just the different trim levels on these Silverados. I'm just, I'm a Silverado nut, so. And I do sure. believe starting next Saturday or in a couple Saturdays, there's going to, have we made the announcement, you guys? about the farmer's market oh absolutely yeah it was a it's our, not a secret now obviously. well yeah that's right you know, not, not a secret now. but uh, uh but we actually did take a truck over this the, the first open oh, then this, it's yeah, not a secret. Yeah. good See? it actually went over very well we had a lot of good reception from it uh and actually that truck that was over there sold that same day so how crazy yeah, uh so it was super, super neat and they really enjoyed Exciting. it so we're going to take over a uh and if it doesn't sell between now and then we're going to take over a red hot uh, Silverado 2500 diesel and possibly a couple other ones too. So it turned out really well. 
All right, go, guys. The Jack Burford Chevrolet. If you want some more Lots information, you can check out jackburford.com. Yep. And uh, come over here. If there's a vehicle you like, they'll be glad to kind of walk you through the process, let you take a test drive in that vehicle, and uh, just kind of see mm -hmm. some of the newer things that not only they are doing, but Chevy is doing as well with these great vehicles. Correct. Absolutely. Not just uh, Silverado, too. Everything has had a redesign. Yeah. Everything inside, technology, the screens, the radios, I mean, wheels appearance just you got to come the out and check our stuff and the yeah trim. it's just so Impressive. much so nice yeah. Yeah, every really little is. detail has gotten extra detail <laughs> yeah. into it and that's 100%. what makes these vehicles special so. yeah absolutely all right well samantha another great show for us as always here at jack burford chevrolet we'll be back over here next month as well and anytime that we're out and about if you know we're going to be at buffalo wild wings jack burford wherever we're at come by and talk to us if you've got a sports topic that you want to discuss feel free to come over if we don't know about it you can fill us in on it and anytime you guys see us out and about feel free to come over join the show and just have some fun with us as always for samantha sure. burford and for our producer austin hanks he is uh james cornelson i'm michael watkins thank you all for listening and watching this has been the walling for sports show thank you <laughs>